guys, today we are going to make a Series 2 LOL doll. A rare LOL doll. Using our own. Using our Series 1 duplicate pieces. So we are going to be making who? Uh, Splash Queen. Uh, I didn't know her name because I never knew her. Yeah, we haven't gotten them yet here, but hopefully we get them soon. We're gonna, I think we're gonna get them on Thursday. If we can find them. So guys, oh, subscribe because we are going to be doing a giveaway of the Series 2 LL Dolls. As gonna, soon as we can get them, we're gonna give a couple away too. Are we gonna open some? We're gonna open some and we're gonna give some away. Splash Queen is a new series too, and she is a glitterati, and we are going to make her using our series one parts. So who are we using? Surfer Babe. Surfer Babe's body. My baby's outfit and Miss um, Baby Cat shoes. Miss Baby shoes. Miss baby. And then what paints do we need? Um. Teal, mm -hmm. brown, pink, Some darker pink. That's our clear glitter paint. Blue. Blue and a light pink. It's sparkly too. It is sparkly. It's sparkly too. Let's get started. Okay, so the first thing I am going to do is paint the hair teal. And since we have the teal out, um, I am going to paint the top part of the mermaid outfit teal. And now on to the shoes. Um, I am going to just paint the top part of the shoe teal and then once that dries I'll put the black line around it and then um, this little bottom part of the shoe is going to be like a tan color. All right, so now we're just gonna let everything dry and then we will move on to our next step. So our next part is to paint the scales, the dress, yeah. <laughs> the scales, we're gonna paint the scales on the dress, light pink. And we're also gonna use a pink glitter paint because this part is sparkling. Okay, I'm just gonna let this dry. This paint does not go on very good, so this is definitely gonna need a couple layers, but I'm just gonna let this dry. And while that's drying, I'm going to paint just the bottom stripe of the shoe here a tan color.
And then while the shoes and the dress are drying, I am going to paint her eyes this uh, blue color. Okay, so I painted the eyes and then when they dry, I just have to touch up some of the white in the corner. I went off a little bit. So what I'm gonna do now, since I just finished painting the eyes and they are still wet, is I am going to put the first layer of glitter on her head. And I'm using just a clear hologram glitter paint. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is just paint a little black stripe across the top of her shoe and then just put a little black dot in the middle. So when I was painting this stripe, I don't know, it's kind of hard to see on here. I did go off a little bit. So I'm just gonna take a little bit of teal and just put it in there. And there, shoes are done. Okay guys, so I'm gonna jump back to the tail here. Um, I have put so far on this middle part about two layers of paint. Um, and it's obviously gonna need way more than that. Um, I'm just waiting for it to dry and before I put more on, but I think I can paint the straps on the dress. And this is gonna be just a, a darker pink. And this paint actually dries pretty quick, so once this dries, I'm just gonna paint the bottom part of the tail the same color. Okay, so we are on to our very last step, which is just to put another layer of the darker pink on the bottom and just to put another layer of the clear glitter paint across the middle of the dress. So her splash queen is all done. And that is what she looks like. Oh, don't you fall over. Okay guys, so that was our splash queen makeover. Make sure you give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and bye. I'll miss you guys until the next video.